Also at five, three students accused of using a lighter to burn a classmate in a school bus attack. Tonight, bus surveillance video is providing new information about what may have happened on a Lawrence Township school bus. RTV6 reporter Jack Reinhardt has been looking into this case and he joins us live with the latest on the investigation. Jack. Well, Todd, the alleged incident involved four students, all of them described as special needs students. And today, Lawrence Township school officials suspended three of the accused pending the outcome of this investigation. The assault allegedly occurred yesterday afternoon aboard a Lawrence Township school bus at the end of class. The alleged victim's grandmother said her grandson got off the bus crying and complaining about the assault. They lit the lighter and put it to the back of his ear, and it's all it was all red, no blister, but it was really red. And they burned a black spot on the uh, leg of his pants. Grandmother called Lawrence police. The investigating officer took notice in his report of discoloration of the alleged victim's right pant leg and redness and complaints of pain on the left ear. Lawrence Township Schools also began their own investigation, obtaining security video from the bus in question. After a thorough review of the entire trip, school officials say the video doesn't support the accuser's claim of the assault. We interviewed the students that were involved who all said that they took his hat and threw it. We interviewed the bus driver. Other than the incident with the hat, nothing else occurred on the bus. Grandmother says all four boys know each other. She says it's not the first time they've picked on her grandson. This has been an ongoing thing since October. I've call, contacted the, the Lawrence police before about it, the same three boys, and I also contacted the school about what had happened, and they said they talked to the boys and told them to leave the alone. Lawrence police have also obtained a video copy of the uh, bus surveillance video and they're reviewing it. And the latest word we have, Todd, from Lawrence police is that this case remains under investigation. All right, it's tough to hear these circumstances. Jack Reinhardt reporting live for us. Jack, thanks.